Jiggity, jig, Maybe jig. there's a hint of racism over there. You know, not too many black people in Sweden, right? Well, Maybe. listen, I don't, I don't, yeah, I don't think there's a, I don't think there's a lot of black people in Sweden. I know this. I know the the Swedish girls love black guys. Love them. Oh, so, do they? Really? Oh, yeah. I got a, I got a buddy of mine who gets over like Rover with the Swedes. He's a black guy. I don't, I, I, I don't know. How, I don't know what to say about this. What do you think? I don't know. I got a friend of mine. Yeah, I would. I, I, I want to say free Rocky, and they're treating them like crap because that's what I read, and I back ASAP Rocky. But these Swedish women, they love they they love black guys. I I I, I got a buddy, and anytime the Swedish contingent of club chicks rolls in, we send this dude directly into the flank. He mows them all down. This census. From Sweden, or just on Google, as of August 2018, there's 10 million people in Sweden. 110,000 are black, African immigrants. Okay, so, right. So this, I, I, let me get this cracking. I mean, this ASAP Rocky guy, he's got real trouble potentially. Does he not? Potentially, I think you you get in trouble overseas. You could be in trouble. No place to be. I, you ain't trying. To, I ain't trying to go into no jail outside of the United States of America, especially warning. because warning. that's one percent. Warning. Warning. One percent. One hundred and ten thousand divided by ten million is one percent. What's the story with this? Wait, hold on a second. I'm sorry. I'm a little. All, I'm all over the map. Okay. What happened? There was a brawl. Supposedly there's a video <laughs> of a brawl. It's always a video. There's now. a video. You got to be careful. There's a video. Supposedly there's a video of a brawl, including ASAP Rocky and his people. And from what I've read, the video shows ASAP being harassed and ASAP kind of defending himself and getting into a little skirmish. Now, what does harass mean? I don't know. Kind of just... If if you saw a video of me being harassed, does that validate my behavior? If I, I don't, I, I don't, I just like don't pushed, know. What, what, if I'm pushed, yeah. If, I if mean, someone touches that's me, that's assault. That's not harass. That's different than harass. So that's if assault. I'm verbally, so harassment is just verbal. Yeah, so if the I video think shows me screaming at you and moving, doing that's this harassing. with my finger. That's harassing. And blah 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 blah. That's harassing. And, and you're trying to go away, and I keep. Kind of coming around you, but I'm not touching you. I'm just harassing you. I saw some video of this kid getting fucking launched by, I think, Rocky. And then there were like six dudes pummeling a guy. So is that assault? How about this, man? You shouldn't be behaving like that in, in Iceland or Sweden. We don't know Sweden. the circumstances. We don't know we don't. What, what could be happening to provoke the behavior. Uh, but something happened in Sweden. <laughs> There's a video yeah. of it. Yes. And ASAP Rocky and his people, I believe, right? Not just him. Is just him? No, it can't be just him. Are in so a, a Swedish jail. Right. Now, the story is, and this is from TMZ, whatever you take from TMZ, our sources tell TMZ the rapper is sleeping on a yoga mat with no blanket. That sounds great. There is a prisoner in the next cell with severe mental issues who slams his head against the concrete wall and hurls feces every which way, and the feces are not being cleaned up. So it sounds like ASAP is just lying in someone else's filth, and the Swedish guards are not doing anything to clean it up, and he's being treated less than a human. Great. Okay? Now, hold on a second. The water we're told. I'm not have finished. We, have we ever ever heard of these conditions before ever in a swedish prison there's until, only an article until asap rocky showed up well no if you google swedish prisons i'm sure you'll see a lot of like oh Shit they looks shape like a up. cafeteria yeah but there are some talk about how the prisons are filling up in sweden so i don't know there's not like vi videos of the great swedish prison systems uh the water we're told this is again from the tmz story yes is not clean. 
and the food is not edible. The benchmark of straight news, TMZ. And hit or miss with TMZ, okay? Sometimes they hit, sometimes they miss. For the first five days, ASAP Rocky ate an apple a day, and that's it. We're told the facility is filthy and disease-ridden. As we reported, ASAP Rocky like a Turkish prison? is being held for two weeks while prosecutors decide whether to charge him for aggravated assault stemming from a street brawl. Despite the video showing the alleged victim harassing and even physically attacking Rocky and his crew prior to the incident. Now, here's where it gets interesting to me. There is a treaty. I was already off this, but go ahead. Oh, we could stop. No, no, no. I want to hear it. There is a treaty. The Vienna Convention for Consular Relations. God. I was unaware. No, no, this is real. With Which both Sweden and the United States both signed. Under the treaty, when a foreigner is arrested, he has a right to immediately see an official from the U.S. consulate. That seems fair. Our sources, whoever they are. What does that mean? TMZ, our sources, you. Did I'm you the call source. in? Yeah, I was like, and you're hey. like a homie Iraqi, so you're like, this is the story we want to spin. Again, Our sources. possible, but this is what I'm reading. Our sources say Rocky asked for the meeting because he knew about the, the treaty. His people, you know, he had to know. If you're going over there, I mean, I'm glad I know about it now. If I ever get arrested, I'm asking. I'm, I know about this treaty. Right. Our sources say Rocky asked for the meeting, but when an official from the American consulate arrived at the detention center to meet him, he was squarely denied access a clear violation of the treaty. Right. Our sources say the U.S. official believes he was denied access because Swedish officials did not want him to see the condition inside the facility. Now we're talking about something else. Here's the deal. Can I just break this down? I've lost. I'm not done. Okay. Rocky's team persisted, and eventually the consulate official was allowed to see him two days later but only in the presence and earshot of two Swedish guards. Rocky and the official could not have a private conversation, and they believe it was a clear intimidation tactic. Our sources say Rocky's team is trying to get the State Department involved to help him get out. So far, the Swedish courts have shut him down. By the way, court proceedings in Sweden are closed to the public and media. Here's the deal. Sounds like he's in this a This kid's going to get out. That's for sure. He's and when got, he gets he's out, out, he's going to tell what happened. He's well. He's gonna he's gonna tell whatever his side is, right? Which is it was filthy and terrible. I don't believe none of that. Really? No. And he's going to get out. It's not like this kid's going to do six years. I think it's four to six years or but something. But it's possible that they could just say screw this it's not, guy. It's not going to happen. By the way, they read stories like this. Of if it's not true, they might get more instigated to do something about it. Yeah, how about this? If you're in the Swedish prison system or you're like a thing and you're reading that they're leaking stories that their uh, jail system is uh, perverted, you're and gross, gonna be upset. You could be even more mad. This could be this could backfire. But here's the deal: this kid's not do this kid's not gonna go to jail. But he needs to learn. This is a sweet kid, by the way. Mm -hmm. And I I know of him, and he's a sweet. I know I don't know him. But I know of him, and he's a thoughtful, sweet kid. That I know. And listen, let me let me just give you some fucking advice, Rocky. Because you know, guys like me, they, uh, Rocky likes to listen well, to guys. Like none me. of in Sweden they get the Shane Show. I and know somebody I, could get to we him. Definitely, we def. Here's the deal, Rocky. It doesn't matter if you're being harassed. It doesn't matter. If people just go somewhere, get in a car, get in an Uber, walk to your hotel, don't ever fucking swing or touch anybody. You've lost the right to be able to do that anonymously. These kids come up. I they by the way, these kids wow. are these kids are itchy to fight. I, I don't you ever been around these guys? No. They're itchy. I, I, they're itchy to fight. They need to just, he, this guy needs to take a lesson and learn the lesson of his life and realize that he's no longer the kid that nobody knew. And now he's got himself a real career and a real life. And he doesn't need to be fucking running around with people and beating them up. I just signed the petition. <laughs> you did the free Rocky petition. Yeah. I don't think I can chip in the $7 to get the petition 
on the agenda, though. I'm, I, I can't do that. I understand. He, I think but he I did understands. sign it. 